good morning you guys so today my goal is to see nine children so i have eight on my schedule and then one parent asked if i could come today since i wasn't able to see the kid their kid yesterday so this is basically kind of like a makeup so i have a pretty busy day today's wednesday and we're gonna see how if this all goes well so far no parent has said their child is sick or i think i can't um see their kids so we're gonna see this today is a mixture of homes and schools and yeah so we're going to see how this goes all right so i have some different items for you do you want to do same okay, y'all so i've arrived to my first school and i'm about to see two kids at this school so the teacher just went to get the little girl so it's one of my little non-verbal ones she's so sweet so cute and we're gonna do some ipad and just request colors and request different objects and we're gonna work on that and i'm just gonna give her some verbal and gestural prompts so i'm gonna record a little bit so you guys can see you want to play with the fuzzy ball or you want to see all right let's do the ball okay all right so we have some different colors so you can see all your options and you can tell me which color you like okay oh yeah hair on it all right ready you want orange can you show me orange touch orange and bring it closer to you so walking in i parked not that far up from the school so i just got like a little bit of a walk as you guys can see and we are currently in West Philadelphia. So primarily I'm in like the West Philadelphia area. So oh. um, this is reality. I went to one of my clients school. I just went to his school just now and he's not here. So I'm going to put this as that he's absent and fortunately I will be able to do like a makeup day, but. Okay y'all so. Since I have a few extra minutes, I'm going to eat my little snack. And I just text a mom to just make sure because I'm not about to make the same with food. This mom has not texted me back yet, but I have a little bit of time, so I'm just about to chill in my car for a little bit. I probably put some notes in. Sometimes I'll go to like a McDonald's or something, but hmm. Wait and so I can cross the street. Once again, I did a good parallel park. Oh. That's green. Now I can cross. So I brought some cool sand. We have pink, green, red, purple, and blue. All right. So I want you to tell me which one you want using a nice sentence, okay? And you have to speak up so I can hear you. Can you see the lights jumping? Yeah. So what's it go? So this says I want and you have to tell me what color so i want to hear you say it okay tell me which color so you can say i want red or i want pink oh, all right we'll do the guy Let's start over okay y'all so i am now at school number three for the day so we are on kid number four so I'm back in the car. Now this kid was on a field trip. So I cannot see him. So that has been two kids that I have not been able to see today. So, so far I have only seen three students, but I still have like about three more that I am going to see that are pretty, like I'm, they're pretty much always there. I have three more that I'm going to see. And then it's supposed to be a fourth one that whose parent asked me to do a makeup. So I might still see four kids today, but definitely should see at least three more. And then I'm going to, but yeah, so this is kind of one of those moments where it's a little bit of a downfall of working as like a contractor and like, because 
for the most part all of my kids are usually here you'll have some that are absent or you know this is my first time that a kid has been on a field trip though this one's a little different but it's all right we are going to so i think what i'm going to do is probably try to go to a library because my next kid i don't see till like i don't see her till 1 30 and then i'm gonna go to get some work done in between go somewhere back and plug up my laptop and yes yeah, so i'm gonna take you guys along with me for this. so i'm at the library downtown in center city philly and this library is huge we're about to go in to kill some time so i just take one of my parents see if I'm gonna see her kid and then I might go back and see that kid since he is here, he was just on a trip. So I will let you guys know and I'm about to go inside of the public library. And this library is free, so that's what we love about it. And it's huge, it's beautiful, so I'm gonna show you. Okay y'all, so I am in the library now. I didn't wanna record because the guy was kinda of like talking to me and basically giving me the information to get on the Wi-Fi, but um, I just reserved like a little room. So I'm gonna show you all on the inside of the library. It's really cute. And I'm basically just gonna sit here. I don't even wanna say kill time because I have so many things that I could be doing during this time. And I'm about to get some work done a little bit and then um, see my next Cherries. We're making cherries? All right, let's make some cherries. Look, I have one small cherry. You're smushing the cherries. <laughs> Hey, it's on your head. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna make some cherries to put on top of our ice cream. Mm, roll, roll, roll. Okay, y'all, so as y'all can see, that my little girl, she was actually here today. She's just like so sweet. I love working with her. And now I'm headed to my next little girl. I have a lot of little girls today now that I'm kind of thinking about it. Um, this child is like two miles away, so it literally takes me like less than 10 minutes to get to all my kids. I'm feeling a lot better because earlier today, as you guys can see, I had a kid that was sick, a kid on a field trip, and this is just showing you guys the reality of when you are a contractor and you can't see kids, it kind of works out, unfortunately. Like, okay, y'all, so I'm finally going to see my last kid of the day. Um, I was gonna have another kid, but the mom, she, an emergency happened, so I wasn't able, which is fine, because that was like a makeup kid. So, I'm just so irritated right now because I had a director really try me, and maybe when I get back in the car, I'll do like a little story time of what just happened, but this is my first time having like, you know, someone just kind of like disrespect me and say a lot of things like, I don't know. And they would honestly, I feel like I literally told this person like, you might have to find another therapist for this child. And this is the director of the preschool. And I don't like to do stuff like that because I feel like the child deserves to be you know to get the services that they need the parents the family is really nice it's just literally the director so i feel as though you know you're not doing nothing because if i leave it's we don't realize with these kids it's like a six to eight month waiting list to get these type of services so if your child this child is fortunate to have somebody that wants to come out then um why are you messing that up for them because you're gonna mess it up for them but yeah, so we'll see how that situation goes and maybe I'll go more into detail of what happened, but I'm just really upset right now. <laughs> so I'm just trying to just, yeah. But as you guys can see, I'm in Center City. I have a few kids that I see that are like downtown area. I feel so much better. That was my last kid of the day. And now I am leaving. Hope you enjoyed the vlog.